Four days after a migrant boat sank off the coast of Calabria, local people are still waiting for answers as to why rescuers took so long to arrive when the boat was first spotted. The state is to blame. The state knows when the migrant boats are coming and they let them arrive. But despite knowing this, they didn't intervene. Now all those people had to die, all those children, the women. If I had seen them, I would have heard them. Anger and accusations surround the lack of a boat rescue. Italy's Coast Guard blames the system used by the European border agency Frontex. It says because Frontex didn't officially alert Italian rescuers, their hands were tied in being able to respond. Shortly after the crash, Italy's interior minister deflected any blame for the delays. The only true thing that should be said, confirmed and repeated, is that the migrants should not depart. You shouldn't expose women and children to dangerous conditions. Words that caused outrage among the country's opposition parties who called on him to resign. Your declarations have transformed victims into culprits. Who are you to judge from the height of your privileges whether one should choose between death at sea or death in their own country? The opposition is now demanding a thorough investigation to determine the timeline of the authorities' response after the migrant boat was first seen on Saturday night. And while the search for the still missing migrants continues on the beaches of Calabria, protesters are hitting the streets in Rome, demanding a change in Italy's approach to offshore rescue missions and to migration as a whole. Johannes Pleschberger, CGTN, Steccato di Cutro, Italy.